With all the talk of Orbi Satellite TV service reportedly shutting down in the United States, it seems like there's no clear answer to this saga, especially since their website is back up and running, advertising the service once again and including a few deals being offered. And some customers may choose to stay with Orbi, but if somebody is not inclined to continue subscribing, they should know that the satellite dish and antenna that's included with the Orbi service is still usable to receive free TV over the air, both with the antenna and through the satellite dish. I should say quickly that since your receiver is proprietary and encrypted, you won't be able to use that, but don't throw your dish away. While you can use your Orbi dish, you cannot reuse the receiver, like I said, so you'll have to get a different receiver. One like this, the Amico Mini HD, or one like this, made by GT Media. But there are other brands on the market. It depends how much you want to spend. In this screenshot from Lingsat, you can see that the Orbi transponders are vertical. That means that they're linear, meaning that their dish has a linear LNB, which is perfect for receiving free satellite TV. In other videos, I've shown you these Shaw dishes that I use to receive free satellite TV. These also have linear LNBs, and since most free satellite TV signals are linear, that makes dishes like this one and the Orbi dish perfect for receiving free satellite TV across North America. And there is a ton of free programming on free satellite TV. You can get everything from NBC to PBS to Court TV to news from around the world, international channels. I'm just showing you a few screenshots from some of my uh, satellites that I've uh, locked in. But there are so many different channels and shows to watch on free satellite TV. And your Orbi dish has the perfect linear LNB for picking all of these satellites up too. And you can always hook your Orbi antenna up to your TV or your digital converter box and then aim it in the right direction to get all your local programming for free. Kind of like this antenna I have on my garage ceiling for some reason. Whether someone chooses to pay for TV service is their choice. But in a situation like this, it should make someone question whether or not paying for that service is necessarily the best decision for them especially since you've already made the upfront investment in the satellite dish and antenna. Why not use that equipment to capture something that's already offered for free and break away from a monthly cable or satellite bill? 